welcome back to another my videos and as you guys read about the title get ready with me like not like i get ready with me but like prep with me for school oh i have school in two days but i don't know if you guys are watching this like that day but i have school the on the 22nd and today that i'm filming this it is the 20th and i'm so i'm excited but not excited for school but tomorrow which is the day before school I get to go to the Beyonce concert with my mom and my older sister. So yeah, but this video is gonna be a prep for school. So I got my hair done. I got like knotless boho, a pink blue, pink blue pink because my hair is dyed pink in the back. So that's what I got. And I love my hair so much, but let's hurry up and get to this video. So for prep, I got all my back to school clothes. So I'm gonna show you guys all that. And we got the camera all set up. And now I'm going to show you guys all my school outfits. I'm not going to put them on, but I'm going to just hold up and show you guys in the camera. I did a video like this, uh, not last year, but when I was going into sixth grade. And and I I don't think I tried them on, but I'm not going to try them on in this video. So I'm going to show you guys. Alrighty, so first, my first shirt that I got, these are all from Sheen, but I'm putting out the outfits that aren't from Sheen. So I got this shirt from Sheen. It's like a crop top. It's like a long sleeve, like light pink crop top oh yeah so yeah i love this shirt so much and then next some of the shirts i got it's the same shirt just different colors like different shades of pink so many shirts are me. but then i got this plain dark pink shirt and yeah i like it. and then i got this i want to say this is like a medium tone i don't even know what medium tone means but this is a like light pink but not light pink shirt and it has like an a heart with angel wing in the middle and i love the shirt also we wore that shirt to my school kickoff but i washed it but it's like kind of wrinkled too but um then i got this shirt it's like the same color kind of but a little bit darker but it has like this like stretchy design on it I'm, like obsessed with pink now but then this is the same shirt as the first shirt that i so you guys the same thing just dark pink long sleeve and this shirt i'm gonna wear on the first day of school so yeah those are all from sheen and then wow and then yeah this shirt is the same shirt as this one just again a uh, darker pink which i think is so cute i might make, i might wear this on the second day of school but yeah and then my last pink shirt i got this just plain this is again like my other shirt just a different color shade of pink it's a different shade of pink and i got this off of sheen too and that's all my pink shirts and then also from sheen i got this i it looked way different on the picture but it's this and i should have got a smaller size but this is like basically for winter i don't know if i'm gonna wear this or not but it has like this like this zipper right here and it's basically just for when it gets cold i know i got this in the summer but yeah. I also got a 10 pack of pink socks. I wore two pair and it's just wonky right now, but I got pink socks. So if y'all see me wearing pink socks over and over and over, it's a 10 pack, okay? But um, yeah, alrighty. And then now it's time for pants. So I got these two sweatpants off Sheen and my mom said I gotta start a shopping for my pants in the little kid section on Sheen because None of these fit me. I had to roll them up. And like, even when it's rolled up, they're like still super huge. Cause I really wanted sweatpants. But these are my sweatpants. I don't know if I'll be wearing these cause they're like super huge on me. But I also got this black pair and these fit me if I roll it up like three times. I think this is the pair or it was the gray ones. But yeah, it was the gray ones. I have to roll them up. Cause you, you see they're rolled cause I was trying them on. So I have to roll them up a lot. So I don't know if I'm gonna be wearing these to school. But I got a gray pair and a black pair. Cause I really wanted sweatpants like look how big they are like yeah but and that's like a small so and then next is my jeans next is my jeans so first i got these again i got so many pairs of jeans off sheen but i was shopping in like the women's section and i got smalls and everything and they still don't fit me so some of them i had to like i can't wear them so these are these jeans and they fit me. It's just a little long right here, but I'll make it work. But I got some ripped jeans. And then I still have a lot of ripped jeans from last year, but I'm gonna still wear those. I just need to wash them. And then I got these black pair of ripped jeans. These also fit me. 
and these black jeans i'm gonna wear on the first day of school with that pink i was it for all the sheen clothes and then my sisters they went to the mall without me because i was like shopping with my other friends for her back to school and then they got me this suit i don't know where it's from but i love this jacket where's this from uh, uh forever 21 oh forever 21 it's from forever 21 hold on i think there's a text from dhb oh wait no it's dhb it's from this refuge thing Heaven. <laughs> okay it's from this store i don't know what they were talking about but um yeah i'm in love with this jacket and i'll definitely be wearing this and I, it just looks so good and it's like it's like fluffy so like it'll keep me warm i will not wear it in the summer or i might wear it in the summer for when it's like cold in classrooms but look how good it looks like i always jump trying to show you guys outfits but this is how it looks and yeah and it has pockets like i hate jackets without pockets and this one it has pockets for the pants i might not wear the pants because these remind me of the mean girl pants that one of the mean girls had on her name's regina and she i feel like she had the similar pants on and yeah these are kind of big but i will probably wear them around the house but not to school i found it but this my sister my older sister picked out for me and she got me this from route 21 and she got me this shirt which is not my aesthetic, but it's very thoughtful of her. But she got the same shirt, so she, we can be matching. And it says, leave me alone. And then on the back, it has this like cool design and it says, leave me alone, even bigger word. So I guess, and it's like oversized. And then at the bottom it says, please do not bother. But I guess I wear this when she wears it because we're gonna be matching, but we don't even go to the same school. And look how big it is. Shoot. Look at how big it is on me. Like, it goes all the way down to here. But I'll just tie it up or something. But then also, with that shirt, she got me these jeans. And so, yeah. They're mid-rise skinny jeans. And I love these jeans also. That was it for my clothes haul for back to school. So, now I'm just going to some other things. So, we were shopping on Sheen. And last year, I brought a mini book bag because I didn't want to carry my big book bag. And my the mini book bag broke. And so, on Sheen, I thought that I wanted to carry a mini book bag, or just in case. So, I got this mini book bag. Um, Sheen, it was white, but this is looks gray. So, I'm opening and show you guys. So, this is the mini book bag, and it has black on the inside, and it has, like, a pocket right here. So, I don't know if I'm going to bring this to school or not, but, yeah. That book bag was just in case I wanted a different, I wanted a small book bag, but oh my gosh but i got this big book bag and i got this book bag from foot locker and this is what it looks like it's black and it has adidas i wanted a better one but this is the only one that i could find but um it's very big and i really don't need all this space because it has this big pocket and then it has this other big pocket and then it has this pocket and then it has this pocket and then it has this little pocket down here and that's a lot of pockets. Like, where was this when I was in sixth grade and we didn't have lockers? But, um, yeah, it's Adidas and it's all black. And, oh, I didn't use it. And then it has, like, a whole bunch of pockets inside. So, I really won't be needing it on a pocket. But, um, yeah. I was debating if I wanted to go back to my pink one from last year. But, I don't know. Because this one is just so big. And then all the school supplies that I have in here right now is just these like divider folders and then i have paper and then in this little one right here i have one mechanical pencil because we were late on school supply shopping and it's all the school supplies i have in here right now but it's okay because i just have to get some from my old book bag or something i don't know but i really don't need all that much i only need like folders which i have dividers basically and then all i need is paper and then pencils and then probably like a notebook or something but that's my book bag and i adjust this the straps and it's still big on me hold on if i like yeah i mean but it's lighter and it's like good but this is as far as the straps go but that's all i need it to be so yeah I got my clothes ready. I got my first day of school outfit ready. I already know what makeup I'm, I'm going to do for the first day of school. And I got my backpack. 
and now all I really need is <gasps> nothing really but I want to show you guys my Beyonce concert outfit so our family just loves Sheen and I got my Beyonce concert outfit off Sheen of course and my mom said that the theme for the St. Louis one was silver so I got this silver I think it's like a crop top but with the pants it doesn't really look like a crop top but this is a shirt it's like a long sleeve i've been really obsessed with long sleeves for some reason so i got this long sleeve silver disco shirt and the best part is the pants so then i got these like it's giving like rain pants but i got these silver um pants for the outfit and it's not the same silver but it's gonna be dark so it don't even matter and so that's what I'm wearing for tomorrow. And I just now realized that I still have a few more things in my bag. So this is my old bag from last year. And there's some things in it. Like a lot of things in it that I'm going to need. So first, I need a calculator. I got a blue one and a pink one. This one is mine. But I want to use the pink one because it's my aesthetic. So I'm just going to throw it in here. Because. And then I was going to pause the video, but I was like, I don't really need to. And then I have this pouch from last year, and it just has some, what it got up in here. Half of the stuff in here, I didn't even use. That's okay. Okay, so I got some Expo markers, and I got three. The way I got toe power, I can pick it up on my toes. Buy some. Okay, I have two erasers, and then I have three Sharpies. I don't know where my other ones went. Another Expo marker, and then glue that smells like apple pie. And so that's what I'm gonna keep in this bag that I have. And I'm pretty sure there's some other small things in that mini bag. Cause this bag was my life. This got me through seventh grade, for real, for real. Um, so yeah, I uh, still got more things in this bag, but I have this sunrise, the sweet sunrise perfume that I always brought cause all my friends loved it and I love it. And it smells so good and it's just been here all summer and I got a new one thinking that I lost it but it's really just in that bag so I'm gonna bring this and then there's another scent in here and it's my mini a thousand wishes so that's also gonna go in there and then I have this a thousand wishes lotion because one of my friends always needed lotion and always used it so I'm gonna put that back in there and then a book I'm gonna bring this book I was reading this book but I don't have a bookmark so I like lost my page but I'm gonna reread it because I've been reading lately I'm, I've been reading imaginary scenarios, like imagine scenarios on TikTok, not actual books, but yeah. Also, I have my wallet in here because I bring this everywhere, and there's really nothing in this wallet but cards that have zero money on it. But I don't know what to do with that yet. But also in the back of my bag, I have this car charger port, which I might need. And then there's some more stuff in the back of this bag. The stuff in here was like the stuff that I used the most. It was just easy reach. And these have safety pins in them. Um, but I got my pink Sharpie. I got this pink highlighter that's like erasable. And I got my skinny Sharpie. So that's also going to go in my yellow bag for school. I need more mechanical pencils because I said that I wasn't going to give my mechanical pencils to anybody when I was in seventh grade. And I did anyway. So. And then the last pocket, this front pocket right here, I just have a oh, thousand wild wows which is what we called them and then just this scrunchie but i can't use these anymore but yeah i'm just gonna put it in my bag and i'm just put it in the front pocket just because i don't want to be searching excuse me i don't want to be searching through all these pockets to find things so i'm just gonna put everything in the same pocket just for easy access i was gonna say easy reach but like easy access but i don't want this bag to be heavy so i don't want to put a lot of stuff in here this year but yeah that's it so i need this is my school chromebook and this is really what made my book bag so heavy oh yeah and this is my friend's fingerprint i still have it from when i first met her but there's a folder in here and it's an old folder that i probably won't use but this was the folder this has everything from seventh grade in here so let's just go through it Alrighty, so in here I have more wows because I'm such a great student. This, how much stuff I'm gonna throw away. So throw away the dismissal stuff and the rest of this I can throw away. In my mind, since my Chromebook has to go in here, I'm gonna put some of my stuff in the pocket just in front of it so I can see some things. 
So my book should go in here. And then my pencil pouch. And then my calculator. And my perfumes are going to go in there. This book bag is deep. And then my Chromebook, I'm also going to put my Chromebook charger in here, but that's going to go in the front part. My school charger is going to go in the front pocket, and I'm obviously going to charge my Chromebook before the day before. So, uh, but I'm just going to put my Chromebook in here. And now it's time to see how heavy this book bag is. Oh my God. It's honestly nothing in here is heavy but the Chromebook. All right. I mean, it's not as heavy. But yeah, y'all think this should consume me? Oh, and it's not as big because last year my book bag was like out here, but now it's like another. So that's all the stuff that I just want to keep in there. Also debating if I wanted to carry around this little bag with me, and I decided not to. Um. So yeah, it has all my essentials in here, like my AirPods, my mini mascara, my eyelash curler, my keys my hand sanitizer this little pouch that I keep like extra money in but I can't there's only coins in there right now and hand sanitizer and stuff but I don't think I want to carry that around. honestly just because I don't know what I would do without all that stuff I could honestly just because obviously I need my keys to get in my house so I think I'm gonna just put my bag on top like that and if I need to I can just reach in there Ooh, or well, my locker it's gonna be okay who cares that's technically it for my school prep so thank you guys for watching my video like comment subscribe and be prepared for my next video which is probably gonna be my first day of school video so love guys bye